This video is going to show you how to calculate the acceleration from a velocity versus time graph. So the question we're going to use to investigate this is what is the acceleration at five seconds? So on a velocity versus time graph, calculus and physics tell us that the slope is the acceleration from a velocity versus time graph. So really what this question is asking us to do is to find the slope at five seconds. So what I'll do in my velocity versus time graph is I'll go over to five seconds and then go up to my point on the curve. And then I can see that it's part of a straight line. So I know that the slope everywhere along this straight line is going to be the same. So all I need to do is find the slope of this straight line right here. So the slope is rise over run. In this case, it's going to be the change in velocity divided by the change in time because the rise is delta V on this graph. So I'll pick my two points on my line or somewhere around the five seconds. I'll choose the four seconds. And then I'm going to choose six seconds. Now I know the change in velocity is always final minus initial, so I need this difference on the vertical axis, and that's going to be the final velocity minus the initial velocity. So that's 12 meters per second minus zero, which is 12 meters per second. And the time is given by my two points, and that's just going to be 6 minus 4, which is 2 seconds. So 12 divided by 2 is going to give me 6. It's going to be units of the rise divided by units of the run. So that's going to be meters per second divided by seconds, that's the same as meters per second times 1 over seconds. That's where I get the units on the picture here of 6 meters per second squared. 